So now introduction to order of operations. And with this one, I actually wish that they had put five plus first because that would have given me the opportunity to remind you that we need to do multiplication and division before we do addition and subtraction. With order, we do not simply do math from left to right. We have to do it in this order. We look for parentheses, there are none. We look for exponents, there are none. Then we look for multiplication and division and we say, oh, there is nine times nine makes 81. We bring everything else down exactly as it was. 81 plus five is 86. And I've mentioned this in another video, but if you are not being intentional about bringing everything else down as you continue, it's going to cause you to create, to have silly mistakes. And so please just take the time, do the math the way that I do it, and it will help you prevent silly mistakes. That gives us 86. And we'll try another. <clears throat> so this is a great example of what I was just describing, six plus four times four. And I'm gonna write this one twice actually. So six plus four times four. I'm gonna do it correctly on the left and I'm gonna do it incorrectly on the right. We're gonna see if we get the same answer. So on the left, I look down my list, parentheses, exponents, multiply. There are no parentheses, there are no exponents. I look for multiplication or division. I do have multiplication right here. So I need to do four times four makes 16. Then six plus 16 is 22. That's gonna be the correct answer. On the right, I'm going to do it the way that I see it in order from left to right. I'm going to ignore the order of operations. I'm gonna do six plus four first. That's gonna give me 10 times four, which is going to give me 40. We'll notice that these two answers are not the same. That's because on the left, I follow the order of operations, which is going to give me a correct answer. And on the right, I did not follow the order of operations. I just went from left to right and that's going to give me an incorrect answer. It's very important that we always follow the order of operations, parentheses, then exponents, then multiplication or division from left to right, and addition or subtraction from left to right. Again, that's gonna give us 22. We'll do another. We've got, 32 minus 20 divided by four. And so I'm gonna scoop my order of operations down here. So I've still got it right where I can see it. And again, it would be, oops. I'll be right back with my iPad screen back. Okay, sorry about that. So. If I did just the way I see it, 32 minus 20, I would get the wrong answer. So uh, similar to the last one, we will do this one twice. The correct way and the incorrect way. So the correct way is going to be able to look at the order of operations and say, are there any parentheses? No. Are there any exponents? No. Multiplication or division? Yes. I have division right there. So we would first do 32 minus five and get 27. If we were to do this incorrectly and just do it in the order that we see it from left to right, we would do 32 minus 20 would be 12 divided by four would be three. That answer is gonna be incorrect because we did not follow the order of operations. It's very important when you see something with multiple operations happening that we absolutely follow the order of operations and check to make sure that we're doing them in the correct order. One more, and we will call it good for this one. 252 plus 42 divided by six. And this is another one that I'm going to do correctly and incorrectly and see what happens. So correct will be on the left, incorrect will be on the right. 252 plus 42 is 294 
divided by 6 is going to be 49. Uh, the way that I figured that out in my head so quickly is that 5 times 50 is 300. That's pretty close to 294, so I need one less 6, which makes it 49. If you have trouble with that and you need to use a calculator to figure it out, no worries. Just do what works for you. Again, if we were to do this incorrectly, or sorry, I just, uh, I just did that incorrectly on the left, didn't I? That's the wrong way to do it. So... Uh, Let's replace these. I just accidentally un accidentally did this the incorrect way. That is going to be wrong because we added before we divided. Going through order of operations is super important, even for someone that's done this thousands of times like me. Parentheses, no. Exponents, no. Multiplication or division, yes. We have 42 divided by 6, which is going to be 7. We bring down what remains. 252 plus 7 is 259. So uh, mistakes are going to happen, even for someone like me that's done this a ton. That's the incorrect way to do this because that does not follow the order of operations. The correct way is going to produce what we've got over there on the right of 259. That's it for this video. I hope that this is helpful.